guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is just going to be a nail art haul um, and also some of the recent stuff that i've bought so i'm just going to go ahead and get right in i have a massive box literally right next to me full of stuff that i've bought over like the last couple of months so i will just go ahead and get started so this is the first package and as you can see it is just chromes so I've got a sort of an addiction to buying chromes at the moment. I absolutely love them. I use them on a lot of my nail art and I'm going to try out some new techniques with them using acrylics. And I really love the fact that they come in these little packages. And I don't know if you can see that one, but it's sort of like a shimmery sort of blue green color. I haven't got a lot of blues in chromes. So I just thought I would sort of get my collection going. How are we all dealing with this heat at the moment? It's absolutely dire here up in Essex um, in the UK. It's about 36 degrees. And I don't know if anybody of you is from the UK, but if you are, then you know that it never really gets this hot where I'm from. So it's absolutely boiling and I don't know how to deal with it. So the second thing that I got is a couple of things. So this is the new, this is the next one. So I got these really lovely gems. Um, I don't know if it's better to show you that way. No. Okay, so yeah, it's got some lovely little like sort of pixie beads in there and some sort of gold shapes. And I really love it. And then this actually came with two pairs of tweezers as well, which I love because I always use these. These are really good for gold foil, sort of silk, any sort of like metallic colored foils um, and leaf and stuff like that. So these are really, really good. And also for picking up really tiny gems. Okay, so moving on, I got some, I got some crystals. These are more for sort of like when I do like nail art workshops and sort of practicing, but I also just wanted to like see what the quality was like, but they look quite good. Let's see if we can open the packet and show you. So if you can, I don't know if you can see in there, but they look really lovely. So I'm really excited to try those out. Just throwing all the rubbish down on the floor next to me. I'm gonna have to clean up. So this next one is gold, uh, these gold sort of like um, jewels for the nail. So they're like gold studs and stuff like that. So I have a couple of these, but I really wanted to get some more. I really, really love this style of nail art. I'm really into Japanese nail art and Korean nail art. So I just wanted to get some more things to sort of incorporate that into my nails that I do with my clients. Um, I will list the prices and try and find the links to every product that I use down below. So I will put that there. The next one is, so all of these are from AliExpress if I haven't noted before. Um, so yeah, all of them are for AliExpress apart from a couple. So the next thing is a denture case. Uh, don't laugh, but this is actually for my nail bits. So these are really good for cleaning nail bits. It has the bit inside. You put your barber side in there and you can clean them and it disinfects them and it's just really handy to have. So I always replace these all the time. So this is about, I think about 69p. This is from Home Bargains. Um, okay. So the next one, I think this is nail stickers. Um, I really love these. I think they're absolutely beautiful. Um, so yeah, I got these. I really want to try some different styles of nail art. So I thought, why not have these in my collection? Because I just think these ones are really good for Valentine's Day and sort of springtime and summer. So again, sort of going in with like the Japanese nail art theme. So I absolutely love these. Um, what's this one? I did order some new tools at the same time. So I think this is them, yeah. So this is the new nippers that I got because I now have an autoclave. So I just wanted to make sure that I have a couple of packs of nippers available at any time. And then I got some bigger ones for pedicures and also it came with this little tool. Um, I know that Navy Pro Tools have a very similar tool, so I will also be checking that out, but this just sort of scoops under. I don't know if you can see how thin that is. So you just scrape under the nails with that. Um, I see I've got a couple more sets of nippers. Oh, 
I then got some more crystals. Again, these are more for like workshops and practicing um, crystal placement for when I do nail art stuff um, on myself. But yeah, please ignore my nails. They really badly need doing. Uh, so yeah, I got some more crystals. I think they're the same as the other ones. Um, okay. What's in this one? Oh, there's quite a few in here. everything in there so oh i remember these so these are so these take up this they all took probably about three to four months to get here it did take a while but i think that is just due to the situation in the coronavirus so i got some um micro beads these are the rose gold color i really love these i love how many you get um i'm really trying to incorporate different sort of styles into my nail art and then i got these packs of gems um, I think you can get them on eBay, AliExpress, stuff like that. So I got some sort of different coloured ones. So I got purple, pink, blue, and sort of like a teal acma marine colour. Um, let me see if I can open this one. So yeah. Look how pretty that is. See, so yeah, I got those. And then I also got these sort of like little pearl things. I just thought these were really fun. Um, again, just really wanted to love the look of them. Just thought, why not? Sorry about that, guys. Someone rung me in the middle of sort of filming. So I think I was just showing you that I got some more crystals. So this is the next package. Okay, so these are uh, nail tips. They're like the Glitter Planet Easy Tips. Um, I haven't managed to get my hands on them. So I just wanted to try these out first. They're really long stiletto nail tips, but they're wellless. Um, and they're really, really good for creating the perfect coffin shape. So I have used these already and I absolutely love them. They're really good. So I will leave the link for those um, in the description. Okay, so this next package is big, but it's just, I can never get them out. It's just holographic bags. So I use these. Um, I was gonna use them for my press on nails, but I've stopped doing those now and I use them for my client packs. So in here, a client will get a nail file, a buffer, um, any sort of like natural nail wood files that they need and then that will stay with them until uh, they leave me so it's just basically I can clean it disinfect it and put it back in the bag and it just saves me wasting all the files and um, because files are really expensive these days so it's just a quicker way and easier way for me to keep hold of everything okay Let's have a look what's in here So this one is um, some flower nail art stickers. I just thought they were really, really pretty and perfect for spring. And they're sort of, I don't know if you can see, but they're sort of like translucent almost. So they go sort of well with any color, but I think over like a really nice burgundy or a white or even something like a black or a rose gold, I think they'd look absolutely beautiful. And I love them. Look at that, how gorgeous is that? Amazing. Almost there. I did get quite a lot, so this is gonna be quite a long video. Okay, so the next thing is uh, prep tools. So I use these all the time. Um, they can be sterilized in an autoclave as well, which is really good. So these are cuticle pushers. So I really love this bit at the, the end here. This is absolutely my favorite. And then I love this bit as well, because it's sort of pointed and curved, so it can really scoop under your natural nail. So right here, it can scoop under, get any of that dead skin off and they're really sharp. So they're really, really good quality. Um, and I think if you don't have the money to spend on really expensive tools at the moment, then they are just as good. Um, what is this one? Okay, uh, so these are more rhinestones. As you can see, I have a problem. I love, I love all this sort of stuff. I never needed any of this stuff. I just thought, why not? Um, I really love the colours, um, so I don't know if you can see them properly. Let me try and get closer. Look how beautiful those colours are, especially this one here, this sort of like pastel mint green colour, almost like a jade colour. I absolutely love that, and they look really, really good quality. And I love the fact that they come in individual tubes as well. So these are all in their individual little pots, and it's so much easier to put away instead of having one massive box, so I absolutely love those. 
Okay. So this next one, oh, this is shell pieces. I do have a bit of shell, a couple of shell pieces already, and they're really, really popular with my clients. So these are just in lots of different colours and you can crush them up and they go in really well with nail art. And I just think for like, I think these were like a pound, two pounds. And for, that was like for the whole pack. So for the whole pack, I think that's absolutely amazing. Um, as long as you can wait with the wait time. But yeah, for two pounds, you can't really go wrong. So I absolutely love all the colours and they sort of have like an iridescent shine to it. Um, let me see if I can... I can't show you because the light's really bad. I'm, I'm actually going to be looking at upgrading my ring light um, to just a better standard one. So hopefully that will be coming soon. So this is just more nippers. So again, I use these already um, and I just wanted to make sure that with everything that's happened, obviously we won't have time to clean and re-sterilise our tools in between because we're just going to be cleaning everything else. So I just thought as long as I have like a pack of nippers, uh, a pack of tools, for maybe four packs that have already been pre-sterilized and everything like that, then I don't have to worry and it's just gonna save me so much time. So these are, this is the next one, it's a big one. This is my practice nail tips that I do my nail art designs on. I just think it looks so much nicer when they're all the same color and all the, when they're all the same length and they're all the same size. Um, so I love these and I always get these off AliExpress. I know that you can get them some, from sort of Miss You Nails um and i think amazon do them but these were about a pound one pound 30 i think it was and you get about i think it's like 120 or 240 i can't remember but they're so cheap and i just get through them so quickly that the cheaper the better to be honest okay oh we're down to like three packages now which is great So these, this is again, I don't remember ordering this. I think this was um, a free gift, but this has loads and loads of tiny little gold pieces, a couple of big gems in there and loads and loads of micro beads. So I definitely will put this to good use. I'm going to put it in a different pot though, because I really don't like these bags. These bags really annoy me um, because once you open it, you can't close it again. So I'm going to be putting them in some different pots. But apart from that, I think they're really lovely. They're really beautiful. They've got a couple of little stones in there as well, which is absolutely gorgeous. Can you see that one there? That's like a little stone. How beautiful is that? And that red one, amazing. And then these are nail decals. I think they're nail decals, or they could be stickers. Um, they're really abstract, and I really, really love the look of the faces at the moment. So I just got a couple. So I got this one, which is just loads of different shapes. Um, for someone who, if you're really struggling with abstract nail art, then these are really good to start off with because you can put them over gel manicures and sort of like acrylics and just encapsulate them and they go really, really well. Um, so I just got loads. At the moment, I'm really loving all like sort of the warmer colours and I'm just starting to like transition into brighter colours for summertime. But I mean, just how beautiful are these? And these were about 70p a sheet, I think. And I'm also loving the faces as well. I wanna get um, the Dixie Plates face nail stamping plate. But until that comes in, I have to just use these, but these are absolutely perfect for what I need them for. And then there's just some more faces there. And I love these ones. Look how cool they are. I'm really trying to up my nail art game and just make myself a little bit different to the surrounding nail techs around me. They're all amazing, but I just want to make my work stand out a little bit more. I love nail art and I'm just really trying to practice as much as I can. But yeah, they're amazing. I absolutely love them. So I just also got some new um, nail pads i use these ones because they are not the fabric ones they're like a paper they're quite thick though um and i just find that you don't get any fuzzy sort of lint or stuff on them on the nails once you've wiped them so i love those and they're about two three two to three pounds a roll um, and then the next thing i got was some business cards um, so these are from zazzle I got 200, they are quite expensive. So I got 200, they're about 36 pounds. Um, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna cover my phone number there. Um, but how beautiful is that? 
I absolutely love the design. It goes perfect with what I need it for. And I just think it's absolutely beautiful. So yeah, I got those and yeah, they were 36 or 37 pounds, but they were on offer. So it would have been about 50 pounds um, if it wasn't on offer at all. So yeah, that's all of the small things. So all in all with this nail art haul, I think I spent around about £3,000. Um, and I know that's gonna sound absolutely crazy, but that is also because I ordered some bigger things as well. So this here, let me move my bin. This here is the new dust extractor. It's a double arm unit. I am planning on going to a salon. Um, so this is perfect for what I need it for. It's a double armed unit. And if I turn it, on i don't know if i can hang on a minute i think there's a switch around here it's got an lcd screen so if you turn it on where's the buttons it comes with a remote control as well which i think is really cool so this is hang on a minute so this is the remote control and I just love it. I think it's really sleek. You turn it on and then you can hear. So that's it on full. Um, to me, that's not that loud. It's a lot quieter than the one that I used to use. And it's also, so this is a double arm unit. It was really, really easy. It also came with a pack of filters as well, um, which go on the inside of here so that when you clean it, it sucks up all the dust. Um, this was 650 pounds. So that was, it was also on offer. I think it's about a thousand normally, but it was really fast delivery, really easy and really simple to set up. You literally just put them together, put these two on top. Like I said, it's a double arm unit, which is absolutely perfect for what I need it for and I will be using this a lot on my clients. I've tested it out myself and I really love it. So yeah, it's absolutely perfect. It was from Heating and Ventilation UK. If anyone wants to check them out, I will leave everything in the description box below. Okay, so the next thing I got is my autoclave. This is the MBio autoclave. It's um, 950 pounds and it's absolutely amazing. I'm just gonna turn it on for you. So this is a steam autoclave. So you can see there, you've got the demineralized water and the, ex the empty jug. If I just close this door, I'll show you. So you just tap the screen and it tells you the programs. And then you open the door and there's your tray. So apparently you can fit eight packs of tools in here at a time. Um, which is really, really good. So that will save a lot of time for me. And then you close it again and it's a vacuum seal. So this is absolutely amazing. Again, really, really quick, fast delivery. Cost me about 950 pounds and that was on offer. And I will leave the link to this down below from Hollywood Nail Supply. But it is the best thing I've ever purchased. So I really do think that you guys should check it out.